What is good, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Foxy. Welcome back to the Fox's Den. Get into another reaction. A little bit of a special one here today. We're getting into Jujutsu Kaisen, baby. JJK is back. Just kidding. It's not back, but we got a little bit of something special. They finally released the Blu-ray version of season two. I don't know the exact details if the Blu-ray version of season two, like if everything is uh, like every episode is a little different or a little bit more polished or if it's just a couple episodes. But I know for sure what we're getting into right now is the Blu-ray version of Sukuna versus Maharaga. And this was episode 17 of season two, I believe, which was already fucking crazy. But this is right around the time when the season was airing, when this episode came out, that a lot of stuff was coming out from some of the employees of the studio of MAPPA complaining about the scheduling, you know, how, how much hard work they've been putting into, but like being forced to put out something that is not completely done uh, because of the scheduling. And they're not, they weren't completely proud of the, the work that was being put out when this episode was airing because according to their uh, perspective or what they had worked on it was only about 30% done in their eyes which looking back at it whenever I watched it and a lot of other people watched it like they, they were this information and these like you know opinions from these employees were coming out right before the episode came out for that week and so some people are kind of like going into this like after hearing that they're like man this episode it might not be as great as we think or something or you know it's gonna be you know a little shoddy here and there and then we get into the episode and i was like damn like this shit is gas still like i mean you could definitely tell in some moments especially like there's this one scene that i remember where maharaga like threw sakuna through a building or something and you could definitely tell because of the speed of the animation that the speed was kind of distracting you from what the animation actually looked like because of how fast they're moving but if you like stop it in that moment and just see, see it look at a still frame within that moment that he's flying through that building and Maharaga is chasing him, you can definitely look that the drawing is not finished and it's uh, a little shoddy. But that's like one of the only moments that stuck out in my mind whenever I watched that episode um, compared to maybe some other moments like, yeah, it wasn't completely polished or this and that. But from the rumors that I've heard of this Blu-ray version, is that it's more polished it looks like you know how it should uh the lighting is better there might uh i think there's also like some additional scenes or you know stuff that is added in that they didn't have time for or that, that just wasn't fit in you know what i'm saying that's what i've heard at least and so i'm excited to just check this out bro because if they're if they were saying that it was 30 percent done and it still like blew me away from what i saw in the first time that i watched it I can't imagine what the fuck we're about to get into, but they finally fucking released it. It's been out, I think, in Japan for, what, like a week now? Maybe two weeks, something along the lines of that. And uh, I've been seeing people fucking react to it or fucking have, like, some crazy, like, you know, like, uploading their reactions to it or um, people, like, trying to upload clips to it to TikTok and stuff like that If in case people, like, wanted to see it or haven't seen it, like, as soon as it dropped in Japan or whatever, right? But I wanted to wait until it was officially up and it is here so i'm excited to get into this we're just gonna watch the fight we're not gonna watch the whole episode we're just gonna watch the fight between maharaga and sakuna and see what the fuck is new uh and i guess just give another perspective on what else is polished and see what the fuck they really wanted to release uh they just couldn't because of the scheduling and whatnot so i'm very excited for this i mean I, <laughs> like i haven't you know we haven't reacted to jujutsu guys in a while because season two ended like a while ago you know it's been a good little while since the season ended and it still won like so many awards for this year's or this past year's anime an anime award ceremony i mean it won so many things i think it still won anime of the year it won a lot of other stuff too i mean this season was absolutely fucking stunning regardless and uh i hope in the future for jujutsu kaisen season three or whenever this comes back that mappa gets their shit together i doubt they're gonna give up their baby like this is jujutsu kaisen is literally their fucking baby bro i doubt they're gonna like let some other studio do it if anything i was talking to one of my buddies and you know apparently one punch man season three is coming out soon according to my knowledge mappa is working on that season three of one punch man but also having alongside of them the studio bones which bones works on my hero academia so 
the fact that they're doing that for One Punch Man Season 3 to maybe alleviate, you know, some of the pressure or, like, you know, crack down on that scheduling and, and get more uh, of what they want to accomplish instead of being, you know, forced or having shit scheduling, whatever the case is, I hope they do something like that maybe with Jujutsu Kaisen in the future once that comes back for Season 3 or whatever. You know, do a combination of two studios, MAPPA, and then have somebody else helping them out or... You know something along the lines of that so we get the 100 percent of what we of what the animators were expecting or, or, or trying to do in their work uh right away as the season's airing instead of having a situation like this you know whenever this episode aired whenever it did and and them not being super proud of what they were forced to put out you know what i'm saying they weren't able to completely finish everything but now that they've had time because the blu-ray they, they can take as much time on that as they want is 100 done now so i'm very excited to get into this let's just fucking check it out dude i'm sure this is gonna be a banger this fight was already fucking ballistically crazy i'm ready to see it polished up and see what the fuck they changed and, and all that stuff so let's get into it if you guys enjoy the reaction please like down below comment subscribe for new hit that notification bell so you the next one's dropping let's get into it jutsu kaisen blu-ray sakuna versus mahoraga Bro, <laughs> like, I remember watching this shit. Oh, dude, nah, this shit is so dope, dude. I miss this show, dude. I miss it already, man. Woo! Give me flashbacks, bro. God damn, dude. This fucking season was so stacked, dude. Ooh. Already, you can tell it, it looks way more polished. I don't notice anything new as of yet. I remember all this. But it, it looks real fucking crisp now, like really good. <laughs> the fucking popcorn, dude. <laughs> so effortless, just went like this. Like, bro. <laughs> nah, family, yo. This shit is crazy, dude. God, when the fuck is JJK coming back, bro? I can't, man. I need this shit. Damn. Oh my goodness. It looks so much better. This barrage of fists right here. Oh. <laughs> Look at all the fucking cuts from his goddamn cleaver. His attack is crazy. Sukuna is ridiculous. Oh my goodness. Just tossed his shit. <laughs> He's gonna start chucking cars. Yeah, that's right. I can't remember if we saw him actually grab a car in the first up in the first iteration of this episode. Absolutely ridiculous. This shit is insane. Oh yeah, let me just let me just fix that real quick. I'm I'm not done yet. <laughs> Bro, I have goosebumps, man. Even though I've already seen this, I can't uh, I can't I can't wait. I can't wait for Jujutsu Kaisen season three. This fight was ridiculous, and now it's 100% done. Like, dude. Holy fuck. Nah, he's looking up like, yo, what am I witnessing right now? Holy shit. Oh, see, right here. This is what I was talking about when they went through that building. That looked way better. Mm. Damn. Oh, yeah, that's when he, yeah, his little mouth in his fucking neck. Oh, my God. Here we go, this is where this shit heats up. Oh my goodness, dude. I need this fucking show back, bro. Bro, the amount of destruction these just, just two people caused, or just two beings, I guess you should say, is crazy. The people falling off the buildings, you can see that so much more clearly now. Holy shit, bro. This fight was insane. Just dis dismantles a fucking train from the subway. 
<laughs> Bro, his face. He actually starts to real like it's like almost like he's almost actually getting worried. Puts him aside that shit just chucks it. Oh my fucking god, bro. Woo! Look at all the people! Oh my god, just getting caught in the crossfire, bro. I feel like you can definitely see that way better. I don't think that was as clear last the when the first time this episode came out. Oh my Dude, the regeneration is crazy. I think that's more polished too. This moment right now, nah, that shit, whatever that shit is. Oh my God. Oh, he deflected it. I feel like that was harder to see. Oh. Oh no, this is new. This is new. Oh my. Now the hands are crazy. The hand, nah. Oh shit. Bro, this is fucking head chain, and he just regenerated that quick. Oh no, that shit was nasty, bro. What the fuck was? Oh my god, bro. Nah, nah, that shit was the coldest shit I've ever fucking seen. That fucking stop. They stopped the soundtrack. Everything. Nah, that shit was fucking nasty as fuck. Look at him go, dude. This is all new. Oh my god, he can't catch up! Oh, that uppercut! Not. Oh, his angle! Oh, okay, and then the. Okay, so that's all that they added new. That's right, okay. Damn, that was like two minutes worth of fucking new shit right there. Because before it, he, would def he deflected the arm like a couple minutes ago, and then it went right to that part where he was coming out of that building, Maharaga. Oh my. Just chuck that whole. Th did, was that is that new too? I don't remember him chucking that shit. This man's just sitting on a light, just sitting on a stoplight like it's fucking another day in paradise. Look at the destruction, dude. It's like it's like he's fucking proud of this shit. Like he he lives for this. Like look at what I'm capable of. The fucking plane is way more detailed. Oh my god. Oh, they in the plane now, right? This shit new too. Oh my god. Damn. Nah, he just hit him with the fucking plane. Yeah, they were talking about 30% done. Looking back at it, I was like, what do you mean 30% done? When I first watched this, I was like, this shit's still gas. No, I see what you're saying now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what the fuck you're saying. 30% done. Holy fuck. The amount of new shit that's in this episode. And how much more polished it is? Jesus Christ. I definitely believe their remarks now about saying 30% done. Look at this fucking shit. Oh my goodness, the tracking just tosses that pillar. Him too- God damn! Bro. I can't believe they elevated this even further. This is this this is what their full vision was, the animators. This is what they truly wanted to fucking do. They just didn't have the time. That fucking smile is crazy. Yo, that looks so good. Maharaga's smiling too, bro. Nah, yo, it's so cold. You could definitely tell that was Megami right there a lot more clear too. That was harder to notice that it was Megami. The famous technique. Malevolent Shrine. <laughs> nah, dude. So gas. This character has got to be one of the most OP fucking characters in all of anime, dude. I don't care. This shit is ridiculous. Restricted it to 140 me meters just so Megami wouldn't die. He could have made it even smaller to, to, to minimize the destruction. Oh, that shit's. Oh my god! Deleted! Erased! What the fuck? 
Nah, 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 the destruction is ridiculous, bro. Oh, this is getting me hot all over again, dude. This is what I'm talking about. I need this fucking show back immediately. Oh my goodness! The phone too, bro? Nah, his domain is ridiculous. Look at how fast he's regenerating. That's so much easier to look at now and follow. Nah, props to the fucking animators and this Blu-ray shout out to this fucking... Like, shout out to them actually finishing this. Being able to see their true vision of what they wanted to accomplish, this is fucking legendary. Goosebumps, bro. Goosebumps all over again, man. Fucking A. An absolute masterpiece. As if it wasn't already, the fact that they were able to finish their vision... That's what I'm talking about. I know what they mean by 30% now. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Just absolutely incinerated. Holy fucking shit, bro. And that does it. Holy fucking shit. I'm, I'm like out of breath. What the fuck? God damn, man. Nah, yeah. I'm so glad I fucking got to this Blu-ray fucking shit, bro. And this shit finally fucking came out so I could watch it. Holy fuck, bro. That, nah, that was a masterpiece. That was a masterpiece. And I was already thinking that the first time I fucking watched that shit. Just because of it all stacked up with the rest of the season. Like, the amount... Th this season was literal masterpiece. Literal masterpiece. And they just elevated it even more with this Blu-ray release. Especially for this episode. I'm sure there's other touches they put on other episodes, but this... Bro, nah. The amount of new shit they added right there. It really kicked off, I think, with the new shit whenever they fucking... Uh, that moment where... He attacked Maharaga, his, his Maharaga's arm was flying towards him and he like fucking like just deflects it, right? As soon as he deflected it in the first iteration of this episode, it showed that building and then like the refractions of the lighting and then Maharaga like kind of glowing and coming out of that building. It went straight to that. But they put like two to three more minutes of fucking shit in between that before you see that refraction of lighting in that building and then Maharaga coming out. Like, they put so much more in that, whatever that fucking, when they killed the whole audio of the soundtrack and everything, and fucking Sakuna went like this and stopped, and then he went like this or some sh bro, nah, that is some of the coldest shit I've ever fucking seen in my fucking life. Holy cow, bro. God damn. That shit. Oh my God, bro. Bravo to the animators for fucking completing their vision and what they wanted to accomplish in this episode. I, I, I wish they had the time to release it how they actually wanted to at this 100% level, but I'm glad we got it regardless. I mean, dude, holy fuck, that was crazy. I'm gonna have to watch that like one or two more times tonight after I'm done with this shit and like editing or whatever the fuck or, you know, just throughout this week. That shit, wow, dude, they added a lot. That's what I'm saying. The main chunk of it started after the deflection of that arm. And then even after, like, whenever he was coming out of that building, like, you could see, like, what they added in new between those two moments, like, deflection of the arm and then him coming out of the building, Mahoraga. Even after that, there was still some new shit. He fucking hit him with the goddamn plane. They started fighting within the plane that was falling. None of that was in the first iteration of the episode. And it just looks so much better, too. Like, it's so much more polished. The uh, Dude, holy fuck, bro. That was, yeah, legendary. Absolute masterpiece. I'm so glad I finally got the chance to fucking react to this shit. And see what the fuck they added in and that that was a lot. That was a lot, bro. If it wasn't already a masterpiece episode, it definitely is fucking now. Shout out to the animators. I mean, they did their fucking thing with this. That's what I'm saying. It's just a damn shame they weren't able to release it as they wanted to because of the scheduling. But like I said, I'm glad we still got it just a little bit later in this Blu-ray version. Holy fuck. 
seeing their full vision for that. I mean, they, they just elevated a masterful fight even more. Like, how, how is that possible, bro? Like, nah, dude, JJK is definitely the best new gen. I think it might be one of the the best shows or stories I have I've, I've seen. Like, this shit, this season, this season two was absolutely crazy. And the fact that they elevated that fight even more and maybe even polished some other episodes some more. And, and I mean, I don't know if there's any new stuff in any of the other episodes, but this episode for sure, it was like the meats of like the c compare and contrast between the Blu-ray and what aired whenever it aired on TV. Absolutely ridiculous. That was fucking masterful. Legendary, legendary stuff right there, dude. God damn, bro. This is just making me itch for more JJK. Like I just, I want it back. And I don't, I, I don't want to read it. This is one of those shows that I really fucking enjoy being an anime only for. And, ah, oh, dude, I can't get enough, man. Like, this shit, this shit is really good. JJK is fucking up there. Really high up there. And I think, it, I think most people would agree. Definitely the best new gen. But in terms of just anime in general, this shit is a fucking ride, dude. They killed this season. And that just fucking proves it to me one more time watching this blu-ray Blu version of that fight i mean god damn i'm gonna have to watch that shit again i'm gonna have to watch that shit again bro that shit was so fucking lit i can't get that move out of my fucking head bro. i love when they do shit like that when the fucking like it's almost complete and utter silence from the chaos and he just went like this and like the the face the animation of his care bro nah that shit was so cold bro amazing stuff bro i'm fucking speechless like i'm gonna have to fucking take a little bit to just fucking chill i mean this is the last thing i'm reacting to today i think but god damn man dude i want you i want jjk back i want it back so badly <laughs> holy fucking shit bro i'm so happy i just fucking realized this i'm so happy for people that haven't watched this show imagine that you haven't watched this show and now whenever you go through and watch the whole thing, the fucking, you know, season one movie and you get the season two and you see the full scale of this for the first time, that's like your first exposure to this episode. You see it in its complete form. That is fucking bliss. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Yo, bro, that was so good. All right, well, I think that's going to do it for me in this reaction. Holy fuck, dude. I'm fucking shell shocked. That was amazing. Absolutely legendary. I I'm so glad the animators got to do what they wanted to do and expose or not expose but just develop their full vision that they wanted to do the first time holy shit bro props to them i, ca I can't ex i can't express it enough dude i'm so thankful that's gonna do it for me in this reaction amazing fucking stuff god is making me want jjk back so bad we'll get it back eventually but what an amazing fucking blu-ray version of this i mean god damn dude i'm just glad they got that full vision that they wanted to accomplish out god Amazing stuff. That's going to do it for me. If y'all enjoyed the reaction, please like down below. Comment, subscribe for new. Hit that notification bell so you know the next one's dropping. I'll see y'all in the next one. Y'all be good. Deuces.